<laughs> I have not seen such a farrago. I had a pass with him, bring your scattering and all. And he gives me the stucket with such a mortal motion that it is inevitable. Box off, don't all meddle with him. I hope he will not now pass it by. Baby, and scarce hold him yonder. Plague on it. And I thought he'd been valiant and so cunning and bent, so I've seen him damn dare I have challenged him. Let him let the matter slip, and I'll give him my horse, great cap of it. I'll make the motion. Stand you here, make a good show on it. This shall end without the perdition of souls. Mary, I'll ride your horse as well as I ride you. I have his horse to take with the quarrel. I persuaded him to use the devil. He is as horribly conceited of him. There's no remedy. <laughs> <laughs> he will fight with you for oath's sake. Mary, he had never thought of him of his quarrel, and now finds that scarce worth talking of. Therefore, draw to the supportance of his vow and protest. He will not hurt you. Pray God, defend me. A little thing would make me tell them how much I lack of a man. <laughs> <laughs> he found you seem furious. Come, Sir Andrew. <coughs> There's no remedy. <laughs> the gentleman will fight with you for honor's sake. But he has promised me, as he is a gentleman and a soldier, he will not hurt you. Come on, to it. Pray God he keep his oath. <laughs> I do assure you, sir, tis against my will.